Hello and welcome. My name is Amulya and you are watching Tube Mint. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install plugins for your Gedit text editor, which is a default text editor on Ubuntu and many other Linux distro. So let's get started. You can see this is really cool features like this terminal and this navigator, so file and folder navigator and cool features. So let's go ahead and see how to install plugins for Gedit text editor. Simply go ahead and tap on this, click on this three lines and then go to preferences and have a look at the plugins. You can see I've got so many plugins. So there are three ways to install plugins for Gedit. So basically the first way you simply go to Ubuntu software and this is now how it's launched so go ahead and click on it and you simply look for gedit if it's already installed or you can go to installed and then navigate to text editor so once you are here you can enable add-ons okay so simply go ahead and check these boxes let's say i have to enable this join lines and split lines I will go ahead and check this box and it will ask for the password. I will enter the password for my user and then it will start the installation process. Once it's installed, you will go to your gedit. You simply have to restart it. Okay. Once your plugins are installed, you will have to restart your gedit and go to preferences from this drop down and then go to plugins and then look for the plugin that you just installed. So when you install, when you launch gedit, you do not have so many plugins. Okay. So where is this join? You can see it's already enabled on my system because it was enabled before, right? So, however, if you have, if you don't see it's enabled, you will have to check this box and it will be automatically enabled. All right, so that's the first way to install gedit plugins. The second way is basically you can use terminal and type sudo apt install gedit plugins. Uh, type in the password. And this will go ahead and fetch everything the available add-ons or plugins whatever you call them and again you will have all these plugins right you may have a few more plugins listed here I already have installed and ran this command previously so it's just trying to setting setting up gedit plugins once it's installed that's the second way to install you simply go ahead and relaunch your gedit text editor and you should have your plugins available under preferences and plugins so simply go ahead and enable these plugins that you want to like these are the plugins that just got installed i don't need this one sync text x text whatever it is okay so this is the second way there are multiple um, third-party plugins that you can install on gedit so let's say there is a plugin called uh, gedit folding okay and this is available here on github there are many plugins that are available on github for gedit some of the, them are easy to install so simply go ahead and clone this in this for location so go ahead and simply copy this one paste in here and then simply have to clone it so this is basically get it folding i will go ahead and clone it however it's already cloned on my system so i'm not going to clone it actually i'm going to just going to show you so simply go ahead and type and hit enter and it will be cloned make sure you have git installed you can see i already have get it folding right so this will just give you this uh, folder gedit folding 
and once it's installed like duplicate so this duplicate lets let me lets me duplicate the lines with the commands so now i'll go ahead and um, launch relaunch my basically restart gedit and you will have your plugin installed the the third party plugins open source plugins available on github so you might see some of your foldings gedit foldings and it's already enabled uh, where is that folding you can see here so this is how you install plugins in gedit first from the ubuntu software panel second from the terminal third from github all right so that's it for this video guys if you have any questions suggestions leave in the comment below thank you for watching bye for now